Hello, Scrabble here, back with more. Travis strikes again. No more heroes on the Nintendo Switch. Last time we finished up with games and... Not games and coffee. Coffee and donuts. This time we need to go get the next death ball. So we're going to go Travis strikes back and get that started. If there's a jump in here or a cut of some sort, well... This thing's been crashing on me. OBS has been crashing on me, so that might happen. I don't know. We'll see. Travis strikes back. No more heroes. Number three. National Census. Come on. Hey, it's Gene. What do we do, Travis? The digest thing again? Yeah, let's do it. I mean, let's do this quick. Sorry, grab my drink of water one sec here. Travis Strikes Back Digest. Do you believe in urban legends? Me? I love them. I'll read any book with urban legends in the title. Now, for the segue. I got word from Kamui. Count Dracula is not only both real and alive, but he's a death ball collector too. So off to Romania. But asking if anyone's seen Dracula is... Well, people just think I'm a tweaker and ignore me. I can't find him with the, just the weak-ass info I have, either. I wandered around aimlessly and checked out this beer hall. A horse with a chip on his shoulder came up to me. What's this now? His eyes are all sparkly. Okay, this is definitely a guy who knows where Dracula is. Awesome. I decided to trust those sparkly eyes. His name was... Epona. <laughs> nice. Let's go, Epona. Take me to Dracula's castle. Epona guided me to all sorts of castles, but we didn't find shit. So I figured I might as well try a fortune teller. <laughs> ah, it's great. What a sketchy ass shop. I pick one from the gaggle of fortune tellers in the underground mall. A big guy with long hair. This dude's huge. This guy must be like seven feet tall. Maybe he's Dracula. And his name is Sundance? A sketchy ass name to boot. Sundance grabs some fresh coffee, spills it all over some paper. Coffee stain spreads in the paper. Sundance reads the stains to Balbonia Castle. Says the Count is in that castle. Gene and I get on Epona, head toward the castle. Apparently Epona and Gene don't get along so well, they fought the whole damn way. Anyway, we get to the castle, but as soon as we get there, Gene just bolts straight into the scary-ass horror movie-style castle. I'm wandering around inside, looking for Gene. This place is probably haunted. I follow Gene into the Great Hall, always break my balls, man. Hey now, there he is. Count Dracula, down on the floor. Something's up here. A guy with a katana is trying to slice the Count's head off. This dude is fucked up. I can't abide my target getting jacked like that. That arm. This dude is also determined. He comes flying at me. This could get crazy. Come on, bring it. But then... He slices the Count's head clean fucking off. He sticks a hand into the Count's brain and pulls out a death ball. Throws it at me. This is what you're looking for, right? I've got no beef with you. Take it, shut up, and leave. Go now, and I'll let you live. My name is Mondo Zappa. I'm with the Federal Memetic Assassination Administration. This doppelganger was a finely crafted fake. The real one is still out there, somewhere. Tracking him down's our job. Dracula acquired tolerance to lighten a quid pro quo with the Reaper. He became doppelganger, able to live in the sunlight. That's all. No questions. I'm done here. I'm off to find the real doppelganger. They say he's in Central America. Anyway, I'll leave it to you. Travis, touchdown. Well, I did kill the game, doppelganger. He just ran his mouth and disappeared. Mondo. It's pretty good. So, there are still a few out there. Whatever. I got what I came for. I'll have Bishop appraise it. Let's go, Gene. Let's punch it. Don't let them catch you. Like hell. I'm approaching vanishing point. To be continued. And the fourth of six death balls is ours.
But we also need to rescue Jean, and I think she's in the uh, fourth house. New article's been added to the archives. Death Ball acquired and new games playable on Death Drive Mark II. Save? Yes, indeed. Can I have a drink of water? Ah, that water's good. All right, let's take our Salt and Sanctuary shirt. Head on in. S save Dean. Gene, not Dean. Gold Dragon GP. Aw, oh, yeah, we're going to be playing that, I hope. But, uh, life is destroy. C rank, C rank, S rank, and coffee and donuts. Man, we're going to have to get all S ranks, aren't we? Are they not letting me pick scenarios in this one? Like, the other game let me pick which toilet I was going to. Oh, okay, good. Let's try four. I don't know if it's four or five. Maybe the first house didn't have a toilet. No, all the houses would have to have toilets. Well, there is blood on the wall here, and Jean said she was in a house with... Or, blood on the floor. Jean said she was in a place with blood on the floor. I probably already had this ramen. Uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure I got everything from, uh... From Life is Destroy, right? Huh, I did not see Gene in there, so I gotta check out Toilet 5. All right, let's just run there. Oh, gosh. Up we go! Come on! I want to lure this uh, head down over here. Okay. Path should be open. Perfect. See if. Yep, Gene's in here. Alright, Gene, I'm here for you. Maybe we'll uh, take down the mini boss while we're here. Yeah, I hear you, Gene. I'm coming. Those guys are gone! There you are. Come on, Gene. 
Ah, wood cat. Come on, I don't want to get hit. I'm trying to do this right. Perfect, then let's take down the mini boss. Who is this? Green Sheep Man. We're going to take him down, activate our, our skill. Sheep Man Green. Come on, Sheep Man Green. Whoa, run! Oh. I hit it before I should have. Got him. I took a hit. I shouldn't have taken it. What are you going to do, right? That happens. Oh, well, it happens, but we can level up. I'm wondering what max level is. Like, is max level 10? If so, we're pretty close. All right, back we go. Time to hit up the golden GP. Gene is saved once more. We're going to save her every time. That's what we're going to do. This is 100% run. We always save Gene. And it took barely any time, right? We're 13 minutes in. We got the death ball. We uh, got Gene. Those are our main goals for the episode. Didn't I just save? Maybe I didn't. I did just take a drink of water. So, perfect timing. Oh, yeah. Let's do it. Golden Dragon G E. Start that game. What do we got? I'm ready. Death Drive. Mark two. <laughs> I love that intro, really. I skip it, but I love it. Music is good, like always. I'm loving the vector graphics. Oh, nice. Look at the weapons on that thing.
<laughs> wow. That's awesome. Taking a picture of that. Because I love it. It's amazing. Did a great job with that. Oh, whoa. This is not what I expected. I thought we were racing. Alright, what are we doing, man? Huh. What a tiny room. What the hell is this? Is this Japan? I've seen this before. This is like Leije Matsumoto's manga, Otoko Oiden. The very Yojohan, where the gods are said to live. Holy shit, this is awesome! Grandpa's words of wisdom. The world of Yojohan is deep. Time flows backwards. It takes time to get used to it. Rely on me if you're in trouble. I'm good at navigating. I can help out. Welcome to the world of GDGP. Your participation. The Smoking King is appreciated. Can you make it to the pinnacle of racing? G1. The road is long and hard. First, you must win the Visitor Cup. Go, claim victory. Grandpa's words of wisdom. The latest VR machine is on the table. The world of Golden Dragon GP awaits. Dive in. Okay, we got a toilet. For a toilet, let's GDPP race. Is this VR? The hell is this? Another one of Juvenile's traps? Well, as a gamer, I can't just sit here and not play this new VR game right in front of my eyes. Looks fun. Let's do it. A game inside a game. Is there no strap? Do you really have to, like, put that on your face? Like, with your hands? That's ridiculous. The worst VR system ever. All right, I don't know how to play yet. I don't look like I have guns. Allow me to explain the race. It's so simple, a monkey could pick this up. Use the button to accelerate. No steering. Just make it to the goal first, understand? Next, I'll tell you how to shift gears. It's the same as driving stick. Move the stick up and down while holding the clutch button. Wait until Mr. P is blue to shift gears. Otherwise, you'll lose speed. Careful of the timing. Nitro can only be used once during a race when it really counts. Use it for an ultra speed up, like a real stairway to heaven. Get the timing right, and you can really turn the whole race around. Okay. This is Accelerate. They said to accelerate when Mr. P is blue. Who the heck is Mr. P? You lose. Okay, Mr. P is the guy on the right. And shifting requires more than one input. Oh, man. Okay, my shift box changes every time. Boom. As far as I know, I was already max gear, so I don't think I could possibly shift up further. We had the one shot to use the nitro, we did, and then I think it's just coast to the end. Didn't look like we took a loss after the nitro wore out, so... What the hell are you doing? Hurry up, get over here. I'm waiting for you, I'm always watching. Don't let your guard down, each and every battle counts. Grab his words of wisdom. Do you know the name of the VR machine? It's the Death Drive VR unit the G2 final race awaits. Dive in.
All right, we're gonna save. Uh, gonna try the G2 final race. I mean, it can't be the final race for the Death Ball. Power recovered. There's no character select here. Oh, interesting. This one does have skill chips and ramen shops and Aztec stones and UE logos and hidden characters. I didn't think it had any of that, so this is interesting. Next up is the G2 final. Time to kick some real ass. Sure, G2 final. See if we can win. I don't think I can win. Too far away. Oh, I have to always keep him blue. So, there, my RPMs are going too high. We have to pump the accelerator to keep it in the blue zone. Alright, 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 I'm figuring this out. You lost. Winning requires strategy. First, you have to pimp out your bike. Try powering up your gearbox. The wiki says it's on the 8th floor of Dragon Tower. First come, first serve. Hurry up. Oh, and the undead monsters in Dragon Tower are hungry for your blood. Get rid of them. Work. Grandpa's words of wisdom. Power up to win the G2 final race. Get a new gearbox. Tweak your death machine. It's hidden on the 8th floor of Dragon Tower. Choose your mission at the entrance. Find it. Every world has power-up items to be found. We're going on a treasure hunt. Cleaning work. Eighth floor. Alright, but I, I don't even know if I need this. Because I've totally figured out some more stuff about how to race. Stuff I didn't know. Oh, fight time. Whoa! There we go. Alright, that covers this area. We got two paths here, branching paths. Probably gonna have to explore both of them, I imagine. Or it won't let me back. But I took the left path. Ah! These guys are annoying, aren't they? I thought I had them all. Well, that room absolutely sucked, didn't it?
Oh, okay, good. I was like, I just put him into another room. Seems bad. Alright, that got all of them. Oh, there's a whole room of coins over there. I tried dodging. Nope. You got me in the back, and you think that's cool? Huh. There's a room there I can't go through. What'd I get? I got Gearbox Z. Now, I'm gonna write down the directions that I took because I feel like I need to go through that place again. Right, like there, I took a left and a left of the two choices that I had. We got the Gearbox. That's totally cool. What's this? Gearbox Z? I guess I'm supposed to stick it on the VR thing then. Grandpa's words of wisdom. Access the Death Drive VR. If the Gearbox Z chip is auto-equipped, the G2 final race will be awesome. Dive in. I'm curious if that counts as a chip. Oh, the music there is pretty good. Does not count as a skill chip. Oh, and I can't leave. Gearbox that equipped to VR. Time to do this right. All right. And now I know more about handling my RPMs, so this should be better. I'm sure that last race I couldn't have won, but this should be better now. Got it. Let's go. There we go, I'm feathering the accelerator. I don't know if it was needed, but I did keep it mostly in blue that time. Looked a lot better about my performance. Although one of the gears, uh, one of the gear swaps I screwed up, that gearbox was really complicated. How's it going? Having a good time? Next up is the G1 semifinal. Win this for a chance to challenge the eternal champion, Smoking King. I'll be looking forward to it. You got any uh, words of wisdom? Your machine can't win with those specs. The new gearbox is on the 32nd floor of Dragon Tower. Go in through the entrance and find it. Alright, next mission. Ah, so we got the... I like how this is part-time job since... Uh, he did work part-time jobs in No More Heroes, so 32nd floor is next, but I want to do one more run through the 8th floor, then we're going to call it a day, and then I think we've got uh, at least two more runs through the 8th floor to do.
next time, tomorrow. Can't believe I let that guy hit me. No, run, run, run. Okay, so we're going to take left first, and then we're going to take right. Because last time we did left left, this time we do left right. These guys are still jerks, eh? No? I thought that was it. Alright, that's it. Okay, let me write this down. We got the left and the right. I don't know if there's more branching paths now, but... At least check it out. There are! We're going left again, by the way. Whoa! Man! I'm gonna need a better way to deal with these punks. Okay, left, right, left. Then there's only the one way to go. Hmm. Alright, we got the extra hit against that guy. Which is where I figured it was needed. Ah! I knew he had three, but I thought he was going the wrong way. We still miss that. All right, I will say that uh, we still miss the thing at the end there. Left, right, left was okay. I guess next time we'll go left, right, right. We're going to save, of course. When I do find something, I will mark down exactly 
which choices were the correct choices. But I think if every floor is this way, then this is going to take a while for sure. Okay, if you enjoyed this video, go ahead and hit that like button. If you want to see more Travis Strikes Again, No More Heroes, feel free to subscribe. Plus, will the channel quite a bit. You can share the video. You can comment on the video. I love talking to people down in the comments. Thank you so much for watching. So, so much. Take care. I'll see you next time.